Hi there, students. But for. Okay, this means if it hadn't been for. Were it not for? Let me give some explanations to make it clearer. But for the weather, we would have had a picnic. So if the weather hadn't been bad, we would have had a picnic. Notice we're using this but for to make a second or third conditional construction. But very often we use this but for noun then I would do this, or I would have done this. But for your help, I would not have been able to finish this. Or, but for your help, I would not have finished this. Okay? So, without your help, yeah, except for your helping me, I would not have been able to do this. Okay? But for your good explanation, I would have been confused, or I would be confused now. So if you hadn't given me your explanation, I would be confused, okay? But for, without something, if something hadn't been present, but for the umbrella that I took with me, I would have got wet. So were it not for the umbrella, if it weren't for the umbrella, if I hadn't had the umbrella, but for the umbrella, then I would have got wet. Okay? But for my boss refusing to give me the day off, I would have come with you. Or, but for my boss refusing to give me the day off, then I would be with you now. Okay? So, if it hadn't been for, if this thing hadn't e existed, but for, but for my girlfriend, my life would be very solitary, okay? If it wasn't for her, if she didn't exist, then as a consequence. Um, but for her money, the man wouldn't have married her. So he wouldn't have married her except for the fact that, but for, she was very rich. Okay? So we use this but for saying, if something hadn't, hadn't existed, if something hadn't happened, yeah? but for you giving me a lift, or but for your giving me a lift, I would have arrived late. If you hadn't given me a lift, I would have arrived late. So the meaning is the same. So but for, if it weren't for, without this, okay? So, I would have given him top marks, but for the small mistakes he made right at the end. So, if he hadn't made the small mistakes right at the end, but for the small mistakes, I would have given him a perfect mark. Okay? So, but for, a nice little phrase to use and remember. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, give it a rating. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.